How's it going guys, Spencer from Berkshire Bass. Today we're doing a little product spotlight on the Mega Bass Pop Max. This is definitely my favorite popper to have tied on all summer long. Great post-spawn bait, really, really good early morning and later in the evening when these fish are getting shallow busted on bait. Um, they come in obviously a bunch of different colors. This is their baby bass color. Absolutely lights out color for Mega Bass, but we're gonna wheel this thing around this big grass flat. I really like this thing around kind of hard structure when there's less wind it's almost a finessey top water for me you know docks hard timber grass flats like i said when those fishermen are bust busting on bait or any kind of you know point that they get real shallow on early and late but yeah we're gonna wheel this thing around see if we catch one on it um the cool thing about this pot max that's very different um compared to other poppers like i've noticed is that this you can really get this bait to walk like a spook but like you're really going to get some awesome walking action on this bait and you can also play with it like an original popper um the big deal in that is the chamber that rolls right through the you know the body of the bait so that water is actually going to be moving right through it but what i like to do especially when these fish are really eating post spawn it's it's not a major long pause for me i'm almost watching walking that thing like a spook and i'll drop a pause in there for a sec um let them look at it if they're tailing it but like I said, guys, throwing this thing shallow, grass flats, points that they jump up on and feed on earlier or in the evening, and uh, docks, hard structure when it's real tough to get a bite. This thing will get a bite for you um, around that stuff. But right now we're just working this big grass flat. I love this thing when it's slick calm. I'll probably go to a spook more when there's some little bit more wind, but when it's slick calm, and like I said, I think about the Pop Max as my finesse top water and a really, really nice setup for it for me. A um, little different, I really like throwing this bait on a spinning rod. This is a Douglas X Matrix, super sensitive. Still got the backbone to deal with bigger largemouth on the Pop Max too, um, but it's a freaking awesome spinning rod and I just got so much control of this bait. I'm really working it with just my fingertip. And uh, Cortland eight pound master braid, it's a straight braid for me. Um, bomb cast, really, really long cast and that's a big deal in any top water bite. You really want to not get on top of those fish um, and really try and trick them. Anytime you see bugs on the on the water or dragonflies or anything like that, that's a great time to pick up the popper. And it'll work all day. It'll work all day. It's not like it's only in a morning bite or, or an evening bite. If it's the right post-spawn pattern, they'll bite this thing all day. So yeah, guys, jump on the website, stop by the shop, check out these Mega Bass Pop Max. Awesome bait really really good post bomb bait i'll be having it on, tied on on my deck pretty much for the rest of the season honestly with you guys and really try the spinning rod out stop by pick one up douglas x matrix available in store and of course portland master braid available in store online too really really nice popper setup I'm sure you guys wouldn't be disappointed in it